Hey, I am reviewing the Scott's Elite 16 inch lawnmower today. I got this lawnmower less than a week ago and currently the grass is pretty long uh, and well what can I say uh, not a lot of positive things to say about this lawnmower so if you're thinking about buying it uh, let me caution you with a few warnings first since I have spent the money and I will be returning it uh, number one this lawnmower and this grass do not work um, the purpose of these lawnmowers these push lawnmowers uh, without a motor is to cut short grass or grass that is somewhat short so if your grass gets overgrown like this grass is here it really does not cut it over here I tried using this lawnmower and uh, the grass is just patchy so it'll cut short and then it's long uh, and it's just it's patchy as can be this and I probably spent I don't know maybe a good uh, hour trying to make it work so uh, if you have long grass or grass that grows quickly probably isn't a good investment. Uh, another thing I'll say about this lawnmower in particular uh, is sometimes like right now I'm pushing it and it's see how it's sort of jammed. If the grass is long, see it's not even moving. It's not, the blade isn't spinning. So I have to back up and then there it goes. So it's sort of halfway. So it'll spin half the time. It just doesn't work if the grass is long. Um, so that's the first issue I have with it uh, is that it simply doesn't work if the grass is long. So, um, you know, you got to keep your grass short all the time and you have to cut it more often kind of thing. The second issue is that uh, these bolts right here, uh, they screw on to the metal and they're just plastic and they screw on like this. Uh, so there's one here and there's two here. The issue with these is um, when you're pushing the lawnmower, uh, you know, you're pushing all these angles and it's just, it's just metal and you can hear it, it's loose. And right here, this plastic bolt came off somewhere, somewhere in this lawn over here, or elsewhere, and uh, I cannot seem to find it. So I've literally been um, pushing the lawnmower, and then this bolt comes out because there's nothing holding it. Uh, so the lawnmower sort of disassembles itself over time, uh, and I screwed things on pretty tight, um, which is surprising because. Um, you know, I guess it just loosens up as you're hitting little bumps or whatever. But the thing was literally disassembling itself over time. So the first issue, doesn't really cut grass uh, that's long. Second issue is these bolts just don't stay on. I mean, they, even if you tighten them really well, um, I mean, use, use your, you know, just really tighten them. Like, that is, that is as tight as it goes. Um, they just don't stay on. Um, so it's really... I was trying to be eco-friendly and get a lawnmower that, you know, didn't use gas and stuff, but it doesn't seem like um, Scott's is going to figure foot that bill, uh, so I'll be returning this. So I would not recommend buying it. Um, I probably won't buy, be, be buying anything else from Scott's for my entire life, to be honest. It was a horrible experience. Uh, so sometimes it just gets jammed and it doesn't really spin. So right now it's only spinning like half the time. Um, see? See what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke. Uh, it really doesn't work with, with long grass. If the grass was shorter, maybe it would work. Um, but yeah, the bolts, they just, they just come out on their own over time. And um, yeah, it really, it just doesn't work, unfortunately. So I'm going to be returning it. So just a warning to those of you looking to purchase this, I would highly recommend avoiding it. I am shocked that it has 3.8 out of 5 stars on Amazon. Um, I think that's incredibly generous. I would give this like a 1.5 out of 5 uh, for the patches that it does cut, but that's about it. So hopefully that helps you in your purchasing decision. Uh, I would avoid it. And uh, I'm a little bit frustrated with that company right now because um, this product absolutely sucks. You can read the reviews on Amazon below if you want to check them out. Um, but yeah, I'd recommend avoiding it.